I made the mistake, uh, I realized it was a mistake in hindsight, of talking, uh, some people were very excited I was going to be here, and I said, you know what, anyone can be as influential as Seth Godin, all they have to do is work really hard for like 35 years, and be a genius. And what I realized after I said that, was that I was diminishing the hard work, and sort of copping out, and saying, as long as you're a genius, the hard work is secondary. And yet, I don't see that come up in your writing. And I'm curious if you would, you would sort of maybe describe why you talk a lot about doing the work and very little about the necessity of being really, really good at something. All right, so there's semantics here, but okay. if I'm a genius, everyone's a genius. So I'm really uncomfortable saying, and be a genius, because it's meaningless, because we are all geniuses in the sense that we are a genius when we solve an interesting problem. Mm -hmm. We're a genius when we do a piece of work for the first time. Because everyone has done that at some level. It's all a matter of degree. Mm -hmm. So, you know, the Einstein kind of genius is solving a problem that's over most of our heads. But I would bet that if a lot of us had been directed enough and trained enough, that would have been available to us. So, you didn't ask me that question. You just started that. The question you asked me is, uh, why don't I talk a lot about doing really, really good work? Well, you know, Neil Gaiman owns that by saying make better art. The idea is not that you have to put in more effort than anyone else. The idea is that your effort has to be more productive than anyone else's in the sense that you solve a problem in a way that's worth people engaging with. That involves learning how to see. That involves learning how to edit your own work to say, even though this took me a lot of time, it's not that good. Even though this took me two minutes, it's worth it. Mm -hmm. And the mistake that people who have been through the industrial economy make is they think that just because the hours are there and they grind it out, they should be rewarded. No. In the connection economy, we don't reward production. We reward the output that we choose. And if we choose to connect with it, it's valuable. So people have to learn to see better and say to themselves, that wasn't good enough. 